Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome to my Six Ad Vlog. My name is Shane, and today I wanna to talk about my upcoming high school reunion. And I haven't gone to my reunions in the past. I've, I've went to one little get together. There was about 10 of us um, from school, and um, it was cool. I, I, um, uh, it, was, it was fun, we had dinner, and we kinda of shot, the, shot the shit for a little while. But uh, I haven't been to a real uh, reunion, and I think my my class had a reunion like five years ago where many people went and um one of the people that's most active on social media that um organizes these things for our class um announced that we're having our 35th uh, class reunion coming up i graduated in 84 and um i um i said i was going instead of being indecisive they wanted a head count for staffing and yada 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 so I said I was gonna go but I don't really know if I want to go or not um, I don't really need to see people that I went to school with I pretty much um, thanks to um, social media and technology we can keep in contact with each other all the time you and your friends whoever it is you and your family we're always in contact with each other um, Facebook and whatever things like that so I don't know if I really need to go to a get together to kind of socialize with the people that I don't really socialize with. I already, the people that I want to keep in contact with, I already do um, from school, from my past, whatever. And um, I don't really see a need to interact with the other people that I went to school with. Not that I have anything against them or that I, 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 I'm trying to avoid anything. It's just when we get there you know like hey how's it going you know that's you know that's nice whatever then it's to me it's going to be like that awkward kind of thing where um you don't really know what to say because you haven't seen these people in my case 35 years and um like i said thanks to um technology social media the internet um i already know about the people that i want to stay in contact with i already know their lives and things like that sorry it's kind of hot out here and um so i don't necessarily know if i really want to go to my class reunion i mean it's 35 years ago and um i can't believe it's been that long and i wouldn't mind seeing some people but if i really want to see them i can look up their profiles online and you know reach out to them and say hey how's it going you know things like that so um, reunions and get-togethers and things like that aren't the same as they used to be in the past pre-technology pre-social media um, so I don't really know if I want to go or not um, I, I'm kind of torn I, I said I was gonna go and um, a f about five years ago I got together with a group of friends we had, my class had a an official reunion um, a while back about five years ago I believe and um, for the people that weren't able to go there was a group of about 20 people that got together at a restaurant and we kind of hung out and it was it was cool but I still I mean I'll, I am friendly towards all these people I don't I don't really have any issues with anybody but it was still kind of awkward you know like what do you talk about you haven't seen these people for um, 30 years or whatever so it was kind of awkward and um, so I don't really know if I want to go to my my reunion or not. Um, as far as I'm concerned, there's not really a point to them, considering that we're always in constant contact with everybody anyway. I mean, what am I going to say to somebody in person that I'm not? I can't say online. And I know the human interaction and all that. You know, it's good to you know give handshakes and hugs. You know and get eye contact and things like that. I understand that, but, uh, but really, what are we, what, what are we going to talk about? I, I, I dread the, um, when I meet somebody new or I haven't seen somebody for a long time, I, I dread the, the initial, what I call a job interview kind of thing where like, Hey, where do you work? Where'd you go to school? What do you do? I don't care about that. I don't see that as important. Um, in my eyes, I don't really care what 
brought you to this point. I just want to see you and say, hey, how you doing? You know, and not, I'm glad that you're still here and things like that. I don't really care where you went to school, where you work, how much you make. I don't really, that's irrelevant to me. And I just see that going to a reunion will just be that job interview kind of um, interaction. Hey, what's going on? What, what you been doing? Where do you work? You know, how much do you make? Blah, 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 blah. I don't care. It's uninteresting to me. Some people do care about it. That's why they ask, obviously. But I don't really care about that. I'd rather know about the person and not their resume, so to speak. I, it's irrelevant to me and I just don't want to get into that situation so I mean it'd be cool to see some people and some some people that I went to school with are much more successful than I am some are less successful but it doesn't matter to me but to it seems like that's what I would be getting into that situation it's kind of like um, uh, I don't want to say a competition but I think you know what I'm trying to get at it would just be, it would be uncomfortable to me. And I, I, I really don't know if I want to go to my, my reunion or not. Um, like I said, I haven't been to one in ever. I went to that thing about five years ago. And um, that was good enough for me. We took pictures. We all hung out. We got group pictures and hugs and things like that, which was great. But, and I think I, I get along with everybody in my graduating class. Um, I don't think I had any, there was any bad blood or enemies back in the day. Sorry, because it's so hot out here. But um, but still, I, I don't want that to be the instant thing that happens that, you know, the, the, the job interview kind of, um, how you doing, you know, what do you do now, and where do you work, and blah, blah, blah. It was just, it makes it uncomfortable and it's uninteresting to me. So I, I'm really torn on what, whether to go or not. There's a couple people I'd like to see, but overall I'm okay not seeing any of them really. I mean, I can, like I said, I can reach out to them on social media, Facebook, whatever, and, and make contact that way. And um, so I don't know, it's, it's coming up next month. This is, we're in August, it's in September. And I, I don't know, I, I might go just for shits and grins I, I'm not sure, but um, let me know if you've been kind of apprehensive about going to a high school reunion or if you go all the time or if you avoid them, whatever it may be. Let me know. I'd be interested in hearing your um, your feedback. And um, sorry, I've got my neighbors around here. I think I'm always in the car outside. And uh, but um, yeah, let me know. See, uh, give me some advice. Give me some pointers. Give me a thumbs up or thumbs down. If I'm And I think that's where I'll end it today, not knowing whether I should go to my high school reunion or not. Um, if this was back in the 70s or 80s or early 90s when we didn't, we weren't in constant contact with everybody all the time, 24/7, it would be a different story. Like, oh, I haven't seen this person in 30 years, or I haven't, you know, heard from these guys in a long time, or whatever it may be. That would be a different story but now we we know what everybody else is doing all the time so is it really necessary to get together in a room and say the same thing that you say online i'm not sure maybe i'm a little cynical and jaded i i, I probably am i know i am but um yeah let me know if you've um, been through this situation before and uh, uh, i think i'll cut it off there and thanks for watching thanks for hanging out and i will see you guys next time later